Hey guys, it's BT Gamer Girl 11 back with another video. This video is going to be for Nerd Block, which dead bug not included. Uh, there's another one. Is that the same one I just got off? They stuck this. You guys will see in the beginning. My metal person, you stuck this on the ground outside. I don't know how it did not get stolen, but it was literally on the ground outside of my mill box, so some bug got on it and died, apparently. I don't know if he was scared of something inside the box or what, but I'm really excited about this box. I haven't got nerve block in a long, long time. I've been going with Super Geek Box and 1UP Box because they're cheaper, but nerve block has been getting, like, really good stuff recently, and they have Beetlejuice in this month's box, and I'm in love with Beetlejuice, so I had to get it. Um... We're going to see what's in this box. Hopefully it's good because I haven't gotten a block in a while. So let's get started. Here's the tape down here. I'm always scared when I... Did I just break something on this knife? I'm always scared when I cut into these boxes that I'm going to cut something inside of the box. Alright. Put the knife up. Or just throw it over there. Okay, so when you open it, here is your glimpse. Alright, at least I don't know what's in this box. I want to reach in blindly and grab stuff out. So let's start. Okay, so the first thing is in a box. And how oh, cool. This is from Alien, which I actually love this movie. I actually rewatched it like two days ago, I think. I watched the 1979 version. This is an egg salt, Xenomorph egg salt and pepper shakers. I actually need salt and pepper shakers. I don't have any, actually. I always buy... This is random. I have random salt over here on my bookshelf because, like, I put salt on everything. So, I always buy, like, those things. I don't actually have an actual salt shaker, like, pepper and salt shakers. So, let's see what these look like. This is a Nerve Block exclusive. This is another reason why I got this box because they mentioned the Alien, and I don't have, like, any... Like, one Alien figurine. That's it. These are cool and really well made. These are porcelain. Alright, so they look like this. That's what it looks like on the front. And you can see on the bottom it's made by TM and Fox 2016. These are really nice. I'm really impressed with the, this first item. Next is... What is this? This feels like a notebook. Handbook for the recently deceased. Okay, I don't know what this is from. Oh, this is Beetlejuice? Really? Okay, this doesn't look like Beetlejuice to me. <laughs> but it says Beetlejuice Handbook for the Recently Deceased Journal Book. And it says Nerve Block on the back. It also says Warner Brothers, so I don't think this is an exclusive. It might be, but I don't think it is. But let's open it up and see what it looks like on the inside. This is really good quality. I can already tell you that. And it's heavy for a little book, which normally means good quality. Alright, so this is what it looks like on the outside. And when you open it, I'm guessing it's just, yeah, it's like lined paper, which is cool. I can always use these notebooks, always writing stuff down. I'm like more of the old school type where I still write stuff down instead of like sticking it in my phone or on my computer or something. So this always comes in handy. I can stick this in my purse or just keep it around the house so I have something to write notes in. So that's nice. Next, I'm really liking this box so far. Okay, this feels like a Funko Pop. This is a Ghostbusters Vitamates Diamond Select Toys Nerve Block Exclusive Vinyl Figure Slimed Ray. Is this a, I don't know if it's, it says Nerve Block on here, but it's just a sticker, so I don't know if that's exclusive or not. I haven't gotten Nerve Block in a while. It says it has a posable head. Does it tell you what his name is? Slimed Ray. This is cool. I really like Ghostbusters. And I don't have, I've never heard of these Vina mates before, so that's something new. It's a better picture of them on the side there. And it says on the back, Dr. Raymond's stance was performing psychological research when his funding was cut. However, a close encounter with a phantasm, I don't know if that's how you say that, fan, phantasm? Fan, yeah. Gave him and his colleagues the data they needed to catch and contain a supernatural entity, inspiring a new venture, the Ghostbusters. That's what it says on the back, so yeah. This is actually really well detailed, and I like how in the background, because I don't, sometimes I take these out of the box and sometimes I don't, 
But I like how this one in the background has kind of got like the slime from Ghostbusters. So that's cool. Alright, so next. This feels like maybe a sticker or a decal. Or it could be a $10 credit to a uh, shirt punch, I'm guessing. No, this is a $10 credit from nerdblock.com, which launches on October 20th, so it's already up and running. That's cool. I probably will be using this. So that's awesome. Next. What, is this a tap? Yeah, okay, that's a shirt. I'm trying to do that last. I'm trying to get under the shirt. Okay, what is this? Alright, this is the Walking Dead item, which is a Nerve Block exclusive. I'm not a fan of Walking Dead. I try to get into the Walking Dead, I just can't. Uh, are these like earbuds? It looks like it's an earbud case, but it doesn't really tell you, but I don't want to open it because I'm not going to be using this. I'm just going to give it to somebody, so we'll see what it says on the little slip. But this is either earbuds or like a little thing to hold your earbuds. It's a little like zombie ear. So we got that. I might actually, it's kind of creepy, but my little sister's in the zombies. So I might actually just give that to her on Halloween. Alright, next. Alright, I can't, I've got to look now because I can't get to the one thing that's down here. This is a print. It says Final Girls and Cinema Survivors. This is Scream mixed with something else. I'm not sure. I'm guessing that's Scream mixed with something else. We'll see on the... We'll see on the little leaflet. And then we have the shirt. We also have a shirt punch $10 credit that I'm going to be using, which is this. And the little card that says November's Classic Bach. Bach. It's now a Bach, not a Block, if you didn't know. Uh, it says November's Classic Block will feature a stylish exclusive from Deadpool. If you guys know me, if you've seen any of my videos, you guys know I'm obsessed with Deadpool. It also says, along with other festive items from Bob's Burgers, Nightmare Before Christmas, and Lord of the Rings. I like Nightmare Before Christmas and Deadpool. I might have to get this box next, next month. There's the Deadpool. There's the rest of them. Oh, God. I'm telling you, these boxes are just killing my bank account. Alright, before we get to the card, let's show you what the shirt is. This also has a little code on it, which is save 10% from Shirt Punch. The promo code is best shirts. If you want to use that code, you can. It's for shirtpunch.com. And let's see what this is. Is this Simpsons? I swear this is a Simpsons. Am I? Yeah, this is definitely Simpsons. I cannot read what it says on the bottom. Parents, brains. <laughs> okay. This is kind of funny. I like The Simpsons. I haven't watched it in a long time. I watched it a lot when I was a little kid. But this is what the shirt looks like. And you can't really tell because it's really... It's black. I can't tell if it's like black or supposed to be dark blue. But I'm pretty sure it's black. But I'll take a better picture and a close-up so you guys can see it better on the side. But this is actually an awesome shirt. And we'll see what the little pamphlet says on the inside. So here's the pamphlet. Not really a pamphlet. It's more like a card. But it says... This month, you got a bonus $10 shirt punch credit. And it also says that, I'm guessing the Nerblock exclusive was the salt and paper, pepper shakers that I can't get back in the box. But that's fine because after this video, they're going to be coming out anyway. It says, pass the salt, add a little spice to your dinner, dinner table with this exclusive alien exonomorph egg salt and pepper shaker set. I cannot talk worth a crap today. But beware of face huggers. And then on the back for the shirt, it says the Simpsons Treehouse of Horror. So it is definitely Simpsons. I thought maybe it was a mashup, but it's just the Simpsons. It says, can't wait to find out what the Simpsons claim will be up to in this year's installment of Treehouse of Horror. Gear up for this annual fan favorite with an exclusive tee from our friends at shirtpunch.com. Check them out for more Wicked Designs. And then we have the Vinamates. Ghostbusters Slime Gray Stance Vinamates Vinyl Figure. Can't get rid of those pesky poltergeists. Bless these annoying ghosts with this exclusive Ghostbusters Slime Gray Stance Vinamates Vinyl Figure. Oh, that's hard to say together. Slime included. And then, I'm kind of disappointed in this, in all honesty, because I was really hoping for, like, a Beetlejuice, like, figure or, like, 
shirt or plush or something and we just got this book which really doesn't remind me too much of Beetlejuice. I was hoping like of Beetlejuice himself but this says new to the afterlife just found everything you need to know about being dead with this exclusive Beetlejuice handbook for the recently deceased journal. Just make sure it doesn't read like stereo instructions. And then we have this one which is actually a coin purse. Warn off walkers and channel your inner Daryl Dixon with this exclusive The Walking Dead ear coin purse. Exact change and crossbow not included. So this is a change purse. I don't know. I might give that to my little sister. It might be a little too creepy for her. She likes zombie stuff. Alright, and then the portrait, which is down here, is a Scream, Ghostface, and Sydney Prescott art print. What's your favorite scary movie? Play homage to this cult classic Scream with this Ghostface and Cindy Prescott mashup art print by artist Matthew Thuring. I'm not sure if that's how you say his name. Check out his other incredible work at mcthuring.com. M C T H E R R I E N dot com. So, yeah, that's everything in this month's box. This was a good box. Uh. I don't know what my favorite is, in all honesty, because I like the shirt, I like the alien salt. The pepper shakers and I also like the figure. The one I'm gonna have to go with is the God, I don't know, is this so hard? Okay, I'm gonna go with the figure. Because I just think this is awesome. But it was really, really close to the alien salt and pepper shakers. So these two could technically be tied, but if I had to pick one, it would be this one. So you guys let me know what is your favorite in the comment section below. I wanna thank you guys for watching and we'll figure out which box I get next month. Yeah, so thank you guys for watching and I hope you guys have a great day. Don't know what this was, but have a great day anyway. <laughs>